Grow your following, nurture those followers, get sales. This is what I call your customer's journey through social media. It's basically the same as your customer's journey through your business. Now, this might sound like a fancy term. Well, what's she on about here with the customer journey? I have no idea what you're talking about. But simply put, it's about the steps that someone takes, a.k.a. a human being. It's the steps that they're going to take in their relationship with you before they commit to being a follower and then before they commit to being a customer. So someone who sees your social media first time round, they see you, maybe they scroll on, they don't react. They see another piece of content, they start to become interested. I actually call these people lurkers. So these are people lurking around in the background who, who are seeing your content, but who aren't taking the action to either react to your content by liking it, saving it, sharing it, commenting on it, or by following you. But they may still lurk around in the background for a while. After this, hopefully, a lurker becomes a follower. And that really is the first step in their journey to becoming a customer. Because they could be a follower for weeks, months, years before they decide to buy anything from you or never buy anything from you at all. They simply become part of your audience. So our job as artists and makers is to bring that audience, those lurkers and those followers along on a journey with us into our world of being an artist and maker. What is your art all about? What are you all about? What are your inspirations? How do you make your work? What are your processes? Show them the life of being a creative. So that over time, you start to build relationships with these people, aka another human being. And so that then somewhere down the line of that customer journey, they're going to purchase something from you and become your customer. Too complicated? Want to talk about that more? Let me know in the comments.